I love the idea of salmon as a festive main dish, and this recipe uses fresh rosemary and warm spices, so everything smells like the holidays. The first step is to set up your poaching water. I'm gonna use about four cups water. You want it to come up about uh, one third of the way up the pan. Add one cup white wine vinegar. Poaching is such a cool technique. You end up getting really perfectly cooked salmon and you don't have to babysit it too much so it's easier than searing or roasting. You'll add three big sprigs of rosemary and half a teaspoon salt. Bring this to a boil. You just want the salt to dissolve and then all the sort of flavors to mix just a little bit before putting the salmon in. Okay, it's up to a boil. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it down now. You'll go ahead and have the salmon. For something like this, I would definitely have the fishmonger go ahead and skin it, and then you'll be all set to go. Season it just a little bit on top. Add it to the water, skin side down. Responsibly farmed salmon is a great bet for this recipe because you're able to get fresh year round. Go ahead and make sure that the salmon's almost all the way covered or mostly covered. And now this is going to poach for about 10 minutes until it's completely opaque throughout and we'll check it in just a little bit. I'm gonna scoot it over and make the cream sauce. For the cream sauce, you start with a cup of heavy cream. Add your last sprig of rosemary. Do about 1 8 a teaspoon of salt. Add a quarter teaspoon ground cinnamon and just a pinch of ground cloves. They can be pretty strong, so you don't want too much. And then my favorite spice in the whole world, nutmeg. You can add a pinch or you can add a lot if you're me. And then go ahead and bring this up to a simmer. You do not want it to boil. If cream boils, it could separate and sort of curdle. So in order to keep this luxurious texture, you wanna make sure that it just simmers to get warm. You can use your whisk. If you want the cream sauce to thicken, it's gonna need about 15 minutes of just really gentle simmering. For the salmon, you sort of want a nice lazy bubble, not a rolling boil. So go ahead and adjust the heat as needed. So I'm just gonna move the cream sauce back here. Bring the salmon back. And the best way to just double check that it's done, slip a little paring knife in between a piece of the flesh and make sure that it's opaque. And if it's ready to go, you can just pop it right onto your serving plate. And this is where a fish spatula that has um, spread out tines really comes in handy. And then the cream sauce is ready to go. It's thickened, so just give it a little stir. Super simple and wildly impressive. Rosemary poached salmon with spiced cream sauce.